Hi guys, Michael Fights of Friends here. It is the morning of UFC 222. It is also the morning of Showtime Dante Wilder versus Luis Ortiz fight. Uh, tonight we'll be doing a fight companion on the UFC undercard. Um, starting at 5, we'll be on Fox Sports 1. Uh, then we're going to switch over uh, as soon as it starts over on Showtime. Two fights over there. Um, you got Andre Durrell. I can't remember the name of the guy he's fighting. But uh, he was bronze medalist, Olympian. And then, uh, of course, Dante Wilder and Luis Ortiz. Uh, two knockout, undefeated killers. And I'm just going to make my quick picks. And I'm going to tell you, going into this, I did not do a lot of research on some of these deep fights. So you're going to have a good chance to beat me if you decide to do this. So, and uh, I think you should. If anything, you can talk, you can talk smack over me. I take Johnson by knockout. This is just like complete impulse on some of these. Uh, Caraway by decision. Uh, Mike Pyle, big, big underdog. He's like three and a half to one underdog in his retirement fight. Um, I just think... Auto is going to be too much for him. I think he's at the end of his career. Tight match up here. I'm going to actually go with Dalloway in the decision over Lombard, though. He hasn't looked the same post Usada. Um, or the same since he's left Bellator, for that matter. Um, Dodson, knockout king. I'm going to take him first round. Um, Darius, can't wait to see this dude. Obviously, a lot of people are also picking him. Hernandez is big underdog, but Benil Darius, um, that'll be fun. That'll be a fun fight tonight. Yoder versus Dorn. Um, I honestly don't know a whole lot about these two ladies. So... I'm pretty much just going to pick the person who's the favorite by decision. That's what I do a lot of times. It's very scientific. Um, Kat Zingano. Actually coming in on some books. Um, a small underdog on this one. You can tell some of these people don't read the lines a lot. Or maybe they just, you know, they know Kat Zingano and they have faith in her. But being a slight underdog, 76% of them pick Zingano. Um that being said, the lines are close. I'm also going to pick Zingano by decision after I just talk smack about him. <laughs> um, Stefan Struve, I just don't think he's got much of a chin left. He also got Arlovsky before his last win, and he lost five in a row. Um, this one, bound to be entertaining, but man, um, either one of these guys could stink it up, to be honest. Um, I, I'm going to go with Herlowski in the second round. Uh, and you got Sean O'Malley and Sakhamthoth. I'm not sure how you pronounce that. Um, I know the odds were like almost tied. But uh, I'm going to go with Boy O'Malley. Second round knockout. And you go in into the co-main event. You Frankie Edgar. I I think he's just going to have a little too much right now for Ortega. I could be wrong. Ortega's a beast. I think he's a future champion. Don't think he's at, at, I don't think he's there quite yet. I think Edgar's going to be able to throw some things at him that might throw him off some. I could be wrong. If he gets Edgar in that powerful guillotine, uh, it could be lights out. But uh, And then Cyborg. Um, if you pick, uh, I think that's pronounced warm body. Yes, and in English, that's actually pronounced warm body. I know it looks like Kunitskaya or something like that, but it's it's pronounced warm body. So if you pick her, I mean, you're probably going to win the whole damn thing because you're going to get like four picks worth in the one thing. Um, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to count on Cyborg getting out of there, knockout in the second round. So uh, fights with friends. MMA Newsroom, uh, those are the two that I'm in this 
Twim, I don't know why that's on my leagues. It seems to be on everybody's league, so I don't pay attention to that. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and save these picks. These are my picks. If you think you can beat me, you probably can because I didn't take a whole lot of time on these. But uh, you're still free to come in and talk smack to me. So those are my picks. Everybody, please go on UFC Pick 'em. Super easy. Just type in Fights with Friends. Type in MMA, MMA Newsroom. You can do them both. Every time you play this, it'll put you in me and Dutch Guys tournaments. Save. We're done. Easy as that. It's not uh, that difficult. Um, I'll see you guys tonight at 5 for the prelims. Let me know what you guys think of this. And I hope somebody else plays this week. See you at 5.